Hi, welcome to the LLM and doctoral students here in the International Tax and Financial Services program. For this uh, short snippet on YouTube, we're going to uh, lectures are located on the Thomas Jefferson School of Law website. Now, you're already used to the virtual private network that is the VPN by now, and we would go to our a library. Menu. And under the, we're used to going down to research databases, which takes us um, to the list of uh, 50 or 60 uh, online databases such as CCH, analysts, IBFD, and so on. Instead, we go up our menu and we see class lectures. So I'm going to click on class lab. and we have new class added, choose a class, step one. When I click on the menu, or choose a class, step one, we'll see that we have many different classes listed. Now, these aren't the lectures, these are the classes. One class may have ten lectures. So we're going to have to still choose a professor if one class has, one course has several professors teaching it. And then we'll have to choose the date of the lecture we're looking for. Let's take, by example, a career services lecture. I would go and click on, by example, benefits of an LLM program. Or perhaps I would scroll down and choose International Business Transactions or How to Get a Career in Tax and Finance Law. But for the substantive LLM courses, I'm going to choose LLM Program. I'm going to select an LLM class, let's select tax treaties. And I still have to choose the date of the recorded lecture I want to view. Let's choose November's recorded lecture. And upon clicking on the recorded lecture, the streaming video will automatically start. I would have to turn my volume up and I would be watching for the next um, approximate hour and a half to two hours. Uh, I can restart it at any time, scroll back and forward, see different parts of it. This is the lecture uh, portion of our server for where we have to put the longer lectures because YouTube limits us uh, to the 10 minute format. Now the other interesting area, just to go back to the lectures, you'll have access to different lectures, of course. So when I go and choose my library and class lecture page here under the students.tgsl.edu, it's going to ask me to log in. So you log in with your JLF backslash username and then your password that you've set up. So while you're an active student, your username um, is used to access the VPN. It's also uh, used to access the, the taped classes, the lectures. Now this is important. You do not need, you do not need you do not need to access the VPN to view the lectures. You do not need to do that. You simply need to come to the website here. So to open up your um, TGSL website, right? Then let's go to our library. 
under library we're going to choose our lectures and when we choose the lectures it's then going to ask us for our username and password no different than if you were going to the uh, by example the IQ web you don't need the VPN to access IQ web to see your registration to print your transcripts to review your tuition bill and so forth um, you simply log in with your username and your password same thing for the Thomas Jefferson School of Law email system should you be accessing it directly as opposed to having it forwarded um, so again you do not need to access the VPN to access the lectures you simply go to the web page students.tjsl.edu and then when you attempt to access the lectures it will of course ask you for your username and your password remember that to access you must use the JLF and the and then your username well thank you very kindly and enjoy the streaming lectures